another bedroom on a budget video and today we have a wonderful participant. His name is Drew, he's 27 years old. He is a music teacher and a tutor and he just really needs his space pulled together so he can welcome both students and hopefully some dates. We have $300 and one day to shop the room. And we also have an HP Spectre X360 who are kindly sponsoring this video today as well. And this thing is beautiful and sleek. And I'm also gonna gift this to him at the end of the video. Shh, don't tell him, it's a surprise. Don't worry, it's not part of the $300 budget, which is good because we have a lot of work to do in there. Okay, let's start the clock. Ready? Let's go see the room. Knock, knock. I'm Mr. Cake. Hey, you don't even hey, need the introduction. Hey, you already know hey, who this hey, is. I'm Mr. Cake. I'm here. I'll take a look at your place. <laughs> You're like our first dude in a while. Hey! Hey! Tell me a little bit about your history with interior design. Zero. Oh, okay. So, I mean, yeah. shoe boxes are now my filing cabinet. Uh -huh. TV found on the street. I love a good side of the road find. That's the theme of my room. Side of the road <laughs> stuff. So, I know that you teach music. I teach guitar, yeah. Which is awesome. And you have your students come in here. I don't want them to come into this room, but Why? sometimes we have to. I don't right. want them to be scared of me and never come back. Really? So that's like an actual conscious thought. It is. You. So we definitely want to change that. We want to make this a space that you are not embarrassed. That would be great. <laughs> yeah, that would be great. So a masculine space that is welcoming, but neutral colors. Neutral. Okay, neutral, neutral. And now, I don't mean to pry, but can you tell me about your love life, your dating life? My dating life. I meet someone I like and then I map out like, wait, they'll eventually have to see my room. That's that's not gonna work. So that just sort of stops it right there. Oh my gosh, you like put the kibosh on it because of your room. Oh my gosh, that is huge. So this space could represent a lot of changes for you it in could. your life. It really could. I'm so excited. You have places you can go today, right? Mm -hmm. Because I want you out of the room so that you can come in and see it. Mm. So that means you gotta get out of here, okay? Go, Drew, I love you. Go, goodbye, have fun. Bye, Drew, see you later, no peeking. <laughs> okay, guys, so let's sketch out the floor plan, shall we? I'm gonna sketch it out and that will also be really helpful when we go shopping to know what we need to get. Okay, so we have a rectangle room here. And obviously right now his bed is on this side. I really like to place the bed on the long side of the wall. I think it kind of ends up making the most sense in a bedroom. And then I think his headboard is in good enough shape and we don't have a ton of budget obviously to get a new one. So let's reuse his headboard. If we can budget it to get him a new, newer, old TV, that would be cool. So maybe a flat screen mounted here across the bed. Now he has that dresser, which is a high boy, which is in good shape. So I think we put that over here, basically where the bed was. And then of course we want curtains, 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 yes. No more blankets on the windows. And then I think we keep the desk actually where it is. I think we give him a longer desk. So maybe something cool like out of plywood. I love that look. It actually looks really cool and kind of minimalist. And then let's mount guitar on the wall. So that's the plan. Now I've gotta go find Joe. Okay, so we're in the car and we are kind of wrapping our minds around this shopping extravaganza we're about to have. Definitely want to get him a new TV. I found one. What, you've been searching? Let me see. 42 inch, for $40. Oh, that's good. Cash only sale. I got cash. Picking up the TV, first order of business. First order of business. Okay, you guys, so we're now at this guy's apartment building where he has the TV that we're gonna pick up. Joey just went inside, so hopefully he comes out with a working TV. Success! Does it work? Yeah, 
it works. Did you test it? Yeah, I tested it. It's uh, it's big. TV done. Yeah. Now we just gotta find everything else. Yeah. shop vintage and collectibles very excited there's already stuff on the sidewalk which makes me feel like this is a very full store because they can't fit everything inside so let's go see oh my gosh those are rad what those lights yeah those vintage old school with like the kind of like leather finish on it should we get them rollerblades no should we get me rollerblades no let me see if i can get these rollerblades on Joey, 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 oh my god. Joey, seriously? Joey, Joey, <laughs> Joey. Oh my gosh, guitar pick storage. Mm, sure. No? <laughs> like he really doesn't have like homey stuff in his room, you know? Those are cool, those blue ones right there. These are cool. Oh my gosh, they're all Shakespeare. Oh my gosh, these are a dollar. Ooh, 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 what? frames. All right, but we do need accessories to style, you know? Look how cool. <gasps> oh yeah, that's cool. Is it? How rad is that? Oh my gosh, look at this. How cute. He moved to California. Uh, yeah, from Missouri? Yep. So maybe he passed some cactuses on the way? Yep. <laughs> okay, great. <gasps> Wait, Joey, look. What? A filing cabinet. Should we use this as the base for the desk? So Maybe yeah, we paint it. it like the wall color or something. Hello? Hello? You got everything you need? Wait, please hold. Oh, I'm, I'm shopping. I gotta Hello? call you back. Mom, okay. I gotta call you back. Hey, Joey. Sorry. Hi, is this an emergency? Hello. Can you please hold? Fishing this is for you. Conference call? Thank mm -hmm. you. Thank you. <laughs> Hello? Yeah, I think I'm ready to check out. All right, let's you go. ready to check out? Yeah. Okay, great. All right. Woohoo! Okay, so we got store stuff. down, got stuff. So now we're gonna head to a big box store and get bedding. We need a chair. We need a chair. I'm gonna see if they have any rugs on clearance. Overhead and light. A, yes, a new light because he has a fluorescent light in his bedroom. We don't have much money left to spend. So. I know we're getting really tight on this budget. It's crazy how far it goes, and we need to save money for the big sheet of plywood so we can do a cool desk. Let's hey! do it. High five. And then let's get lunch. High five. Boom. So we just hit up the big box store and scored, scored, scored. So the rule there is go straight to the clearance section or the returns area and see if there's anything that you can find a deal on, which we did. The spark was a return, $30. Look at these Ooh. neutral tones, right? Neutral for Drew. And how about this chair, ladies and gentlemen? Oh, Look yeah. at this beautiful chair. bistro chair. We can put it in his room as an accent chair and it can also be for his students. More plants, cup for his pens. This was just a mug. Um, more clearance uh, candles, two candles, a little notebook. I love this too. Look how pretty that is, canister. And then, very important, beautiful gray sheets. Look at these. Look how pretty, classy, yes. Look at this beautiful comforter, neutral and gray. And then I'm very excited about this basket. $9.99. Score! And it's so cool, look, it's this that laundry really cool. on it. And then look at these beautiful curtains. And then I love this pillow, just one throw pillow. We only have the budget for one throw pillow for the bed, but I really love this pattern. The only thing we have left to get is all the hardware store, stuff. hardware store stuff. A great budget saving tip for you guys, go to the hardware store and already have your cuts in mind and they can pre-cut it for you there. So you just can leave with the pieces and then screw them into the wall. You don't have like an expensive table saw. All right, well, can you just draw the desk how you want it to look so I know how to get the wood cut and I'll run to the hardware store and do that? Uh, yeah. All right, I'm thinking we use the new chest of drawers as the base yeah. for then a new desk that goes like into the corner. And that'll be a nice look way longer desk so that he'll have room to sit here with his chair. But then if he wants to have his student 
helps it next to him in the smaller chair. Cool. Yeah. But then I also want to build like a backing for the desk that kind of goes up. And then we have maybe some like little ledge shelves. So we could either have like one ledge shelf in the middle or we could have like one here. All right, so we're gonna hit up the hardware store, get the wood, and then maybe a little lunch. And lunch. we'll see you back in the room. Wait, Joey. What's up? I like the back side of this headboard better. Look. What do you mean? It's not the same? No, because this is like the stripes, but then on the back it's just solid. Oh yeah. I think that's like a cleaner, that's more minimalist. So, plant. Here's your pointer stick. Oh. It's the window blinds thingy. Oh, thank you. All right, so plywood desk going over there. Yep. TV mounted there, our new old TV. New old TV newer, mounted. Newer old TV mounted. Oh, also some kind of guitar DIY mount. guitar mount yep. over there. New curtains. New curtain. Curtain rod. His high boy dresser here. And then I have a DIY clock project. Mm -hmm. I want to do above this. That's going to go here. I think since we have the leftover of that dark gray paint, yep. we should paint dark gray here, white, white, white. Popcorn scenes we're not touching, obviously. No, but, we but want change to out that, that light. light. Yes. By the time you're back, I'm gonna have painted, installed the desk, mounted the TV, curtains on the wall. Sounds great, bye. Light up. How much time do I have left? Oh. Okay, we better get going. time my favorite time we are going to be doing some music themed DIYs for this music teacher but you know keeping it minimalist keeping it cool not being cheesy with it right so I saw this clock online that I thought was so cool it's a clock where they use the music notes to signify the time so like a quarter note then a quarter note plus a half note then a whole note whatever like they basically use the notes to add up the numbers around the clock and I thought that was so cool and it looked very minimalist. We don't have the budget to buy it, so we're gonna DIY it. Okay, so I have here in front of me one of the frames that we got at the thrift store, very inexpensive. I've taken it apart and I took out the glass because we are going to be using a clockwork that I'm gonna put behind and then drill a hole through the middle and then attach obviously the hands on and it can run around on the front of our piece of paper here and then I'm going to draw with my pretty calligraphy pen the music notes just very simply in black on this kind of aged paper that was already in the frame already cut to size thank you thrift store and then this is just my template I'm gonna sketch it out lightly with pencil first so that I know that it's centered and I like it and then I'm going to poke through with my sharp knife to feed the clockwork through and then I'm gonna go over with a pen and erase any pesky pencil lines after I'm happy with the look. I'm gonna replace the picture hanger that was on this side. I'm gonna put it up here. So we have something to hang from at the top since the clockwork's gonna be right in the center. We need something that sticks off the wall about the same amount as the clockwork. And now it's time to attach these little beauties. Guys, I'm a clock maker. I'm like, Geppetto, and Joey is my Pinocchio. <laughs> now I just have to put it back in the frame. I'm just gonna use the frame surround, leaving this open, of course, no glass in front, and put it on the wall. It's so cool. Oh, got a saggy hour hand. I'll fix it. Okay friends, we have our chest of drawers here. It's a little beat up, but I have to say it looks a lot better than a stack of old shoe boxes, which is what Drew is currently using for all of his papers. So, I'm not a huge fan of this green. I mean, I like green, but this green is a little bit bright for our neutral color palette. 
So I wanna paint out these drawers again. I do have my sander on hand to just get rid of some of this peeling paint. the celebration of music from the guitar here to our music clock over there and his dresser that was already in here like looks so much cooler now with the brass accent our amazing laundry basket that was so cheap oh and then I love the asymmetry of the pendant light over the bed it's like you know a kind of cool twist on a bedside lamp and then we're using our side chair as a side table and then this thing that Joey built is just so rad has such a beautiful kind of whimsy to it and then of course I hope he's very excited about his gift where is he Drew here's your chair all right Joey do you have Drew yeah I got him right here okay come on in all right Drew ready I think so See your new bedroom. Oh my god! <laughs> You're a real boy, you can have your, your guitar lessons in Look here. Oh my, you, how did you build this? We built, built this. this. How did you build this? Wait, I have to look at it. It's one piece of plywood. Isn't that great? Hanging guitars. Isn't Hanging that guitars. cool? Now you're legit. <laughs> oh, how Locker. cute. We've never seen that before. Yeah. Oh we we brought you into the current uh, decade yes. with the TV. I didn't even see that. <laughs> what do you mean you didn't see? Wait. There's so many things to and see. And the remote's over here, so this is your now cool looking chair for your students to sit on. So this is your bedside table. You just take off the remote and the candle, pull it over, and have your, your music lesson. Wait, by the way, ready? Ready? We did this all for under $300. <laughs> There's, I, hang on. Do you love it? There's okay. one more thing yes, too. I love yes. it. Cool. We're gifting you this HP Spectre X360 laptop. Oh my god! You can god. sit there. You can kind of flip through the music. Wow. And then yes, you get to keep it. You can say, you know what? You know what, music student? What I really want you to do <laughs> is I want you to focus in on this part. I want you to go ahead and staccato this. So this obviously wasn't part of the $300 budget, but this is just an extra gift for you. I yes. accept. I yes. accept the extra Yay. gift. I accept it. Oh my god. Thank oh, you so much. I'm oh, so glad. Kate handmade that artwork. Oh my god. It's a clock. Music oh. note clock. Oh, right? bro, oh it? my. You're a real boy, and I'm Geppetto. It's so creative. And, and you have new drawers, too. So no more shoeboxes. Oh, yeah, more no shoe more boxes. shoe boxes. <laughs> Get rid of those shoe boxes. <laughs> and we put the fridge in your closet. I don't need that, that anymore. Yeah, that's, that's, that's I don't need that. <laughs> this is a room. Yes. It is. It's a room and it's a place to do business and to sleep and relax. 
So all the sleeping, relaxing happening happens on this side, and then the work happens. And the here. kids are gonna come over to take guitar lessons and go, oh, I wanna be like this guy when I grow up. I wanna have a yeah. plywood desk. And the ladies, not only the students, but the ladies can come over now and be oh, like, Oh yeah. You have a really cool laundry basket. Yeah. As a lady, I respect that. <laughs> I'm so excited to live here now. Oh, I'm so glad. You deserve it. You, you should give Kate a guitar lesson. Anytime. Oh no. Give Kate a guitar really? lesson. Anytime. Yeah, take us out. I'll just okay. I'll be here. I'll be the I'll be the parent. It's the song about finishing his room. I don't It looks so I... lovely. This is the end of the episode. I think I'm scratching like I scratched Winston and Roxanne. <laughs> Drew, hope you enjoy your room. Beautiful! Wow. Lift us up for you, Drew. Mm -hmm. Oh, please. Moving out of your hair. Thanks, buddy. Thank you. Thank you enjoy so much. It. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I'm Thank just you. gonna reset this. This goes here. This goes here. No pressure, but keep it like that. Okay. Oh, you. All right. Bye. Bye. See you later. Thank you. <gasps> oh, Yay, gosh. Drew. He's so cute, you guys. The power of design. It is deeper than just paint on the walls. It means something. It helps your mood. It expresses who you are. And thanks for HP for hooking us up with that. Uh, Spectre X360, that thing was awesome. Oh my gosh, thank you so much because I'm so glad we got to also get that to him. It's gonna be so helpful for him with his students, with the sheet music. Well, if you guys wanna see more uh, holidays unboxed, go to youtube.com backslash unboxed. <laughs> Subscribe yes. if you aren't already. We love you, Creative Weirdos. Thank you so much for watching our videos. We couldn't do it without you. So if you like the design, our beautiful, neutral, minimalist, manly, minimalist, Space, leave us a music note emoji in the comments below. Sing us a happy song with the happy music notes. Or a rollerblade emoji. You should have seen me out there. I was kind of I, I saw you from above and it was scary. You were like in the middle of the street and cars were zooming by. Okay, guys, we will see you in our next video. We're gonna head home. I love you. Bye. Ah. But um, bam. Well, that's okay. Cause we live in LA. The norm. The norm. The norm. Norm. The thrift stop norm. Boom.